had to go to bed on Thursday. So tonight, after I edited the video and I posted a sale for New Year's Eve, and I made some soup for dinner, like from scratch, which was pretty cool. And I watched a bunch of Nailed It, the holiday Nailed It, which if you guys haven't watched Nailed It, I'm actually pretty, it's pretty funny. Um, so I folded laundry and I had to like get stuff ready for bed because I have to like refill all my pills and whatever. So now I'm just sitting in bed and waiting for my husband to come home. Thankfully, this was a short week, and thankfully tomorrow is Friday, because <laughs> it's... Oh, I just, I need more time. I think Marshall and I are going to watch a movie tomorrow night after we come home, but I have some other stuff I have to do. I don't know. This is like the story of my life. I have stuff to do. So I'm listening to this book for a paper and glam book club called Getting Shit Done, and so far... It talks about like how we as women basically do more and do more and get more done. Like, and we're programmed to do that to get more done, but we're not happy. And it, the reality is that we need to be more focused about what we're doing with our time and do the things that are actually meaningful, rather than just saying yes to everybody and doing everything that we're expected to do. So, I think this is going to be a good book. Um, I'm also listening to this other podcast from the woman who makes the Cultivate What Matters planner that Marshall and I are doing. And she kind of was saying the same thing. Like, be intentional about your goals. You know, know that you can't achieve them without failing. And you have to do, like, little baby steps to get there. So I'm glad I'm listening to, or reading and listening to both because I feel like it's really going to help us with our goals this year. Um, one of the goals I have this year is to really just clean out what we have in our life and pare down. <laughs> we don't need as much stuff. We really don't. So we end up donating a lot of stuff. Um, and especially like being a YouTube reviewer, at the very beginning I got so much that I never used and it just went bad. So I, I don't really do that as much when I review anymore. Like I do some things, but... I don't do it a lot, so, yeah, I think 2019 is going to be good. It is Friday. <laughs> I just got off work. Um, and of course, it's the Friday before New Year's, so everyone has holiday-itis. Nobody wants to do anything at work right now. We're just, we're just all kind of, like, restless. Um... So, now that the weekend is starting, um, we have some stuff to do tonight. Uh, tonight we are going to plan out uh, our goals for 2019, and we are going to sniff some scent combinations for some upcoming products for February, March, April, May. And uh, I'm actually really excited about it. I want to see if these scent combos work or not. Um... We, I think we are going to continue doing the vlogging. Like I said, we might not do it, like, every day. But we also want to start planning out better YouTube videos now that I'm, got, now that I have more energy. We want to plan out more YouTube videos. We're thinking, like, um, you know, things that we do around Orlando, obviously. Uh, food, how to eat healthier, how, what we're cooking, that kind of thing. Just so that we can be, like, not only held accountable, but, like, share this journey that we're going on with you guys as well. Um, so that will probably be happening in 2019 also. Um, I did want to make a note that if you guys are not following the Instagram UOTM Life, it's actually the Universal Orlando team member Instagram, and they just posted, like, the second or third post about Earl the Squirrel. So if you are not familiar with Universal Orlando, the big Christmas tree that they have in New York has a little squirrel perched on an ornament. I knew nothing about this and I've worked here for like eight years. So um, there is a this little squirrel and his name is Earl obviously. But they follow him around, they tell him all these facts and it is adorable. Not only that but you can kind of see a lot of the things that team members do in uh 
their work or a lot of the perks that we get like so it's a really interesting instagram to follow and i'll leave it down below so you guys can see it so anyway that is uh that is friday so i cannot wait to get home and get some stuff done i'm in the parking garage at work i'm about ready to leave so um I would love to hear from you guys down below. So let me know how you feel about, you know, what is happening on this YouTube channel because we really do want to put out content you guys want to see and it looks like the viewership has dropped off a lot. So we're just wondering if that's because of the holidays or you're just over it, <laughs> whichever one. So let us know. It's Saturday afternoon and the boys are both at work and this morning, I edited a video. Marcel and I watched a movie um, about a topic which will be in February's Zany Laney theme. And then after the boys went to work, I played a little bit of my Lego Incredibles video game that I got for Christmas from my husband. And then I cleaned my office cleaned out the drawers, did a lot of cleaning there, so that was good. Um, and now I'm just, my back is kind of hurting a little bit, which is good because Marshall and I have a massage scheduled for tomorrow. But my back is hurting, I'm a little tired, I'm just trying to recover some energy before I make dinner, which is probably going to be asparagus and some homemade soup. Um, but now I'm just working on my 3D painting and watching Bridget Jones' Baby, and then I'm probably going to watch... Sleep is in Seattle because my brother got it for me for Christmas. So I'm probably going to watch those two movies while I'm waiting for them to come home. And just really chill and rest and recharge. Um, even though I'm actually quite happy because tomorrow everyone's going to be off. And they're going to be off on Tuesday too, which was quite a surprise because we thought Marshall was going to have to work. But he doesn't. So we might get to go do some stuff this weekend, which is great. Because then we can vlog a little for you all. But, um, what are you guys doing? You tell me.